Hi there, my name is Barbara Hamilton and I'm an interventional radiologist and I was asked by our friends at Surgery Girls to make a video on proper scrub technique. So I'm gonna demonstrate that here. Um, so one of the sterile procedures that interventional radiologists do that actually requires a true surgical scrub is placing a port. So like a port for chemotherapy or venous access. And so I'll demonstrate that. So you can see I have my lead apron on, uh, I have my leaded glasses and normally I would have my surgical cap on already, or my uh, surgical mask on already um, for protection because you don't wanna have to do any of that after you've scrubbed. So first you lay the brush. This is a chlorhexidine brush on the sink. And if your hands are dirty, you wanna wash those, do a regular wash beforehand before you do your surgical scrub your sterile scrub. Um, and you'll notice I have nice short fingernails. I don't have any nail polish on um, and I ha don't have any jewelry on. So that's the proper way to do a surgical scrub. This sink is an automatic sensor. So it'll come on when I put my hands here and you wanna get your hands and your arms nice and wet. Other sinks will have like a foot pedal so that you're not touching anything with your sterile scrubbed hands. I guess this is actually, this, oh, here it is. I was looking for this little pick. So this is the, to clean your nails before you scrub. So you use this to actually sweep under each nail. Just do that quickly um, to get any gunk out from under your nails. And this brush is preloaded with the chlorhexidine, but if you don't have one that's preloaded, you will, soak this up with the um, whatever solution you're using. You'll use the brush, the abrasive side, and make this kind of a little fist with your hands. And then back and forth, you'll scrub under your nails. Get a little soap in there while I scrub. And to avoid making a mess, you'll do this over the sink. Okay. And I think the rule is you do this like 30 times. <laughs> Get really clean under those nails. And then I'll do my, my right hand. So I'm scrubbing under the nails. Okay, once I've done that, then you wanna use the soft side of the brush for the rest of your hands. So you'll scrub the palmar surface of your hand. Again, you wanna do this really thoroughly and then you'll proceed to each surface, the side of your thumb, the other side of your thumb, and then each side of each finger. I'm getting this on my lead. That's okay. Okay, so you can see that this is a really thorough process. You wanna do the back of your hand, and then you work your way to your forearm. So you wanna do the whole forearm and then you repeat on the other side. So I'll do the abbreviated version since I'm not going into a port right now. Okay. Soap flying everywhere. Okay, and once you're finished, please don't throw this in the sink, throw it in the garbage for the sake of your fellow surgeons. Um, and then as you rinse, you want to make that same kind of puckered gesture with your hand again. And rinse all the way down to your elbow, maintaining your hand above your elbow. So that as the water drips down, it drips off your elbows and doesn't contaminate your freshly cleaned hands. Now you're ready to go in. You'll back into the operating room um, using your backside and then grab a towel from the scrub tech and scrub in. Thank you. <laughs> nice. 